So this problem gets weirder and weirder. I seem to have found a different resolution to some of this. Um, some of the tips were that you should sort of only suppress like all marked objects or whatever, but the problem is when you have um, all these here that you have sort of suppressed just by clicking this, the objects themselves are still pressed uh, behind it. So what I found was that when you have an object like like this one that does not want to show, um, you have to go into each of the subcontainers and manually remove the bodies because they are somehow overlapping the one who's actually sh supposed to show. Like on the on the one here, I had I couldn't understand why can I not make it see through like showing the lines even though I had set it up correctly and added view and uh, see now it's like this as you can see it, it shows correctly now uh, maybe I was editing the wrong one I don't know showing one to one the other one here is not showing now but uh, so, so um, actually, I was editing that one. Now you can see it because I managed to edit the view. But, but what I found is that some of these, it's kind of random which one it is. You have to deselect all of them. Like, leave the main one untouched, the one you actually have. And then you have to go into each and every one of these and disable each and every one of these bodies for every single base view you imported and then when you get to a certain point the object will reappear so here at the view I'm just gonna see if I can get it to show again it was supposed to be like that and maybe with some like that uh, and it still shows gray here. I don't want to correctly show. And what may happen now is when I go in and I remove all these uh, sub bodies that should have been sort of not showing when you de when you deselect this, you shouldn't show it. <coughs> uh, in some cases, you can see like the 3D model suddenly shows because you removed. Uh, a body that maybe was similar in shape, maybe it was like a copy, you used it for something else and uh, and then suddenly it will just show like I know some of these have a lot of underbodies like this one and has some molds as well where the molds are actually sort of bigger than the object itself so that could hide it. So if I do this on the molds, every single object, and eventually what happens is that you get to a point where there is actually no other, like this is actually it has the same layout as the one that we are showing. So you get to a point where you have no other objects hiding and sometimes you can scroll down and you can find oh but didn't I remove that or unhide it earlier no you did not it's still there look here suddenly I find these so for every single one of these I have to go in and just pay attention to the drawing. It's this object here I'm I'm changing. So just look for the arrows that have been expanded. Cause I reused a lot of the base views here. 
see every time you click on this it sort of updates the image as well you have a root node sketches and sometimes like one or two of these bodies I found these to actually be uh, annoying because it, it prevents a lot of the the thing is for showing now if you get to a point where uh, everything seems turned off just go through the list again make sure everything else except the one you really need is disabled this is annoying as hell now you can go into the one you really need which is this one then you disable it and then you re-enable it <coughs> and now since it's the only one actually showing properly it will not disappear again problem is you have to do this for every single one of these that you actually did so what I would like fusion to have is that when you click this it should totally disable and hide not just not just gray out the objects from view it should just make it disabled like uh, suppress it properly not just the uh, main container because I think it would fix a lot of the problems people are experiencing with uh, with this uh, here I use the same one for two different models uh, not sure how that goes but I think I could just disable the ones I don't need here as well I think what I did here was I created a new base view from this part uh, to here uh, and maybe it only uses the same one that I'm not sure but anyway that was one more thing I just wanted to share that I observed